How about this story? Christian Vasquez get loose right now for the Boston Red Sox. They're facing the Houston Astros, except for one slight wrinkle. ESPN's Jeff Passan reporting Vasquez has been traded to the Astros. So this is a little awkward. He's taking BP right now for Boston before his farewell to Houston. How do you feel about being traded to the Astros, Christian? It's a business. It's a business. And that was it. He was gone. Luis Garcia, the first one out of the dugout for the Astros. Garcia, 8 and 6 with a 3.81 ERA in 18 starts. 99 in the third inning, 76 hits, 31 walks, 107 strikeouts. Two out of nobody on for left fielder Alex Verdugo. And that is strike three call. Fastball right by him on the inside corner. And the inning is over. Nathan Ivaldi was used to throwing to Christian Vasquez. And about two hours ago, he figured he would be doing it. The 32-year-old, 4-3, four a 4-43 ERA on the year. And really, that ERA boosted by a couple of bad outings. Outfield straight away against Yuli. And Gurriel drives this one toward the right center field gap. Racing back is Cordero at the wall, looking up. And it's off the top of the wall. And Gurriel goes into second base with a one-out double. Missed a home run by maybe a couple of feet. But here's Jordan Alvarez. He swings at the first one, hard on the ground. Gilmer Sanchez will throw it to first, down to third. Goes Yuli Gurriel. Two out and Gurriel at third for Letmi's Diaz. There's a chopper to third. Arroyo has it. He throws to first, and Diaz is retired. Well, Nate works around the one-out double. Very nicely done. Very quickly, two down. That's four fly ball outs of the five hitters. And with two down, here's Franchi Cordero. Swing and a foul tip into the glove of Maldonado. A high fastball gets Cordero. Second strikeout for Garcia, and the inning is over. The Astros have got a two-out rally working. Two on, two out for a guy who's probably pretty crestfallen today, Martin Maldonado. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, did Nate. Splitter staying away from that four-seamer again, but it works. Nate, that's his first strikeout. Through two, no score. Here's Bobby Dahlbeck in the seven hole. 2-2 two -two to Dahlbeck, and he drives this one to left center, and that one looks like it's going to go all the way to the wall, and it rings just left of what would have been a home run. Wow, was that close to a homer. It had the height, had the distance a few feet right, and that ball is gone. Dahlbeck, he's still on second base with two outs now, and it's the leadoff man, Jaron Duran. 1-0 to Duran. Swing and a drive down the right field line. If it's fair it's trouble it's way back and it is off the track and over the wall for an automatic double Bobby D comes home to score and the Red Sox have a one nothing lead pounded by Duran loud contact here in the third and a night where shock waves were sent through their clubhouse they don't look distracted they lead one nothing that one does get away Duran will go to third second real short pitch from Garcia a little off kilter the beginning of this game and it's two balls and two strikes Breaking ball, got him. Strike three upstairs with the breaking ball. Bogart's right through it, and that's the third out of the inning. One run on two hits. One man left. We'll go to the bottom of the third inning. Arroyo has it go under his glove on a kind of a tricky hop with some top spin, but Altuve reaches to begin the bottom of the third. Yeah, it was a bit of a tricky hop for Arroyo, but I'm sure he'd tell you he should have made that play. Here's Yuli Gurriel, right-handed batter. 1-0 Gurriel, double play ball. Bogart's right underneath his glove. Altuve will head to third and to second sliding safely is Guriel. The left side of the Red Sox infield fails them here. Well, it's too early to intentionally walk Alvarez, but man, they got to be careful here. This was hit pretty well in the left center field. Back on it, Verdugo, onto the warning track and makes the catch. Tagging is Altuve. He'll make it easily. Sacrifice fly by Alvarez, and we're tied. Pretty good two-strike hitting there. Lemmy's Diaz the batter now with Yuli on second. Kind of a 50-50 call on Gurriel whether or not he would tag it second. Breaking ball. Rib down the left field line. That's going to roll to the wall. Gurriel's going to score easily. Diaz racing for second, in there with the slide. A double for Aledbys. It's two to one Astros. Astros really making those two Red Sox errors hurt. And think about the base running by Yuli when he reached on the error by Bogarts getting to second, put him in a position to score on Diaz's double. There are two down, top of the order. Here comes Jose Altuve. Broken bat, soft ground to third, racing in under the Royo. He bare hands, throws the first. What a play, got him. Excellent job by Arroyo. And it's a one, two, three, fourth for Nate Evaldi. Here's Duran, who doubled in a run his last time. Two down. This ball is driven deep to right field. It is way back, and it is gone. Have a night, Jaron Duran. Two runs.
run bomb, and the Red Sox move back in front. It is three to two. Two balls pounded the right for Jaron. That was a jolt from Jaron. Some pretty impressive resilience, I think, for the Sox. One run Red Sox lead here is the man who leads the big leagues in OPS, Jordan Alvarez. Great two, good one there though. Gets the call, strike three, and old Alvarez is down. Now let me Diaz. Strike three called on the outside corner. He tapped his toe, did Nate a little change delivery, and he froze Diaz. Back-to-back -back punch outs, 96, and Nate is cruising. Sox leading 3-2. to two. Pena is 0-2. for A couple of fly ball outs. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Nasty curveball in the dirt. Ploiecki picks it, tags out Pena. That is three strikeouts of the last four hitters, and they're two down. The 3 2 Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Did Evaldi. How about that? Nate has struck out four of the last five and he is rolling the Red Sox lead the Astros after six Nate Evaldi all the stuff going on he's thinking about it his name is in every single trade rumor and he's pitching brilliantly strike three called on the outside corner 95 mile an hour fastball Evaldi has been awesome three and two to Martin Maldonado with one down Swing and a line drive in a right field, but it hangs up. Franchi froze now, runs in. Did he catch it? No. A misplay by Franchi in right field. Puts the tying run aboard. That'll do it. Here comes Alex Cora. Nathan Waldy walks off. I mean, he should be, he should get a huge round of applause for whatever Red Sox fans are here, and certainly the guys in the dugout. And let that not be the last time he walks off the mound in a Red Sox uniform. That guy is the epitome of a gamer. Here comes John Schreiber. And what an ask of him. He'll see Jose Altuve as the go-ahead run. Slider softly hit to the left side. Gloved to third to second for one. Relay to first. Double play. Arroyo Sanchez and Bobby Dahlbeck. John Schreiber does it again. Nathan Avaldi remains in line for the win. Tying run in scoring position. First and second with one down. They'll lean on Schreiber here, Rob, to get them out of this eighth inning. Check swing. It's a ball in play back to the mound. Schreiber gloves. Throws low. What a pick by Dahlbeck. Over at first for a huge second out. It looked like Schreiber had difficulty getting it out of his glove and Bobby bailed him out two down on the play but now the Astros have two in scoring position Jeremy Pena 0 for 3 tonight fastball called strike three on the outside <laughs> corner and there is John Schreiber strutting barking screaming off the mound Kevin Pluecki He'll have a bruise on that right hand. He just took a high five from John, who is fired up. Mark Berman is reporting that Jake Odorizzi, the Astros, who just had a terrific start, has been traded to the Atlanta Braves. I think he knows. It's out there. I don't know if he's been told. And the Red Sox are an out away from a win. 3-2 the pitch. Swinging a ground ball to short. Bogarts waits. He gloves. Steps to first. Throws in time. Ball game over. On the day the Red Sox trade away their catcher, Christian Vasquez, filled with emotion. They win the opener in Houston 3-2. to